Alright, so this wasn't the plan for today's video. Um, I've got like a bunch of clips saved up from Verhunga, and I was gonna go on a hunt and just kinda like integrate them, but I had to bail hay yesterday and hay fever sucks. So um, yeah, I just been running around, <laughs> ran into this guy. So I figure we're gonna start with that, if you'll let me get a shot off. That was a little bit high. Accidental spinal cord shot, no worries. And uh, yeah, like I said, I, I think I have three? three other clips of uh, stuff from Bronga. And yeah, the clips are from actually a while ago, two of them. I just, uh, one of them was like the night before the Yukon, and I think the other one was maybe a few days earlier. But obviously, you know, Yukon hype didn't want to release them then. And actually, it's kind of a good thing I had them saved up because like I was saying, hay fever, I don't think I can sit around and record a proper video. So yeah, we'll get a can check there with a the spring buck and go check this guy out. All right, we are good. By the way, I think I'm going to maybe do a poll here on YouTube, uh, the community tab. I'm trying to decide what to do for tomorrow's live stream. So I think it's either going to be like a Hirschfelden uh, roadier call, where I just try to shoot as many as I can as sort of like a respawn thing, see if we can get any diamonds in there. Or we might go back to the Yukon. So uh, if, you, if you're interested in watching the stream, that poll should be up sometime Maybe tonight or early tomorrow morning. But, all that out of the way, we got our accidental spinal cord shot. Didn't land too horribly. Get a quick screenshot. And, just a gold. Pretty much figures when you see level 5 male Gims buck. 940, but... Huh. Right, double lung and spinal cord. But yeah, um... Got these three clips. Like I said, some of them are a little bit older, but hopefully you enjoy. So I've just been hopping around multiplayer and just randomly a level five spring buck comes walking through here with his herd. Like, uh, I, I have no idea what they're doing. They must just be moving to a zone, but we'll try to get them actually. Just take them there and ah, I shot that one. The vertebrae, I think. Totally did. I think I missed. Okay, at least I hit it. That's good enough. So yeah, um, probably not a diamond. He's got the smaller horns, and most of those tend to meet me these days, but figured I'd better press record just in case. So, can check is fine. Nice vertebrae shot on that, but the good thing is we did make the shot on the five, so we'll run over here and see if he's actually going to make it. Didn't actually land half bad. He just got that one bit of his horn kind of hiding, but if we sort of hide that behind the other horn. And, hey! Actually a diamond, 951. Is that my first one that's got this rack that actually made diamond? No, I think I had one more. I'm pretty sure I did. Same score, even. I think I had another 951, but, yeah. That's cool. Get to add that to the lodge. That is a level 5 male Gims buck. And a big one. He's definitely got the uh, the potential diamond horns, so I've got the 300 on me. I really haven't even tested it on Gimsbuck much. So I'm going to try to kind of just like work my way down around him, I think. Because I don't think I brought the collar for him. I'm pretty sure I don't have it. So if he just stays as he is, eventually I'll get down and around him. And we should be able to get a, a pretty decent broadside shot. All right, I think we're getting pretty dang good. It is a 300, so it should be able to punch through and make up for a less than ideal angle, so. Just pop him and get an accidental spinal cord shot, because that's just what all my games buck end up being, but yeah. I think that's going to be my first non-Yukon diamond with the 300, so that's pretty cool. Get that as a can check as well. And we don't have it. That is why you check, but somebody's stuck over here, I think. Yeah, hello. How are you? Good shooting there, but uh, I guess since he's stuck, it doesn't matter. But yeah, we'll go and hopefully find one more thing, get us up to 80%, and then we can go and take a look. I think that'll work. I don't actually know how far that is, but... Uh, alright, guess it was a little further than I thought, but that will do the job. 
got us at 80%, so now we can actually go look. Huh. Did he actually run a bit, or what the heck happened there? I have no idea what that's about, but he actually has both horns uh, out of the ground. That's kind of nice. But, oh, oh come on. <laughs> He's max weight and one away from max score for a male Gemsbuck. They they max as males at a nine sixty. So that's just about figures. But yeah, second male diamond Gemsbuck and bigger than the last one. So maybe the next one we get will be max. But nice to add another one to the lodge. Man, this might be the most excited I've ever been to see any animal in this game. You guys might remember I, I kind of started like a Cape Buffalo hunting series thing a while ago looking for a rare uh, Cape Buffalo and I just, I don't know, I couldn't find one, but literally I just joined this multiplayer server. I happened to be at that outpost last on Verhunga, so just happened to catch them like going across here. It kind of sucks it's a level 2 female, you know, not going to look super impressive in the lodge, but it's going in the lodge. I don't care. That's so, so cool to see. So I've got... The 300. I might go for like a 7 mil brain shot. I was talking about in a recent video. I don't remember if it was the last one. Uh, that I could not get like the height right. Just realized I actually unequipped that. So get that in there. Oh god. Uh. Alright. Can you be alert? Hopefully I can sidestep that. Be alert please. 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 I'm gonna die. Ah, I missed the brain anyway. Hmm. I just need to not get run over. That'll help. Alright. Of course I had to deal with a charging boyo. Can you not... Okay. Actually, it's probably going to do that weird thing. Yeah. So hopefully we got intestines or something on that albino. I mean, like I said, level 2 female, so not a big deal to get the score out of it, but it still isn't down yet. Actually, it's a leucistic, not an albino, but I ended up with two flesh wounds. I'm not sure how the second shot didn't catch something, but yeah. I don't think she's going to die. We're going to need another shot in her, unfortunately. There she is. Okay. So, hopefully. Another hit. Or two. We'll bring her down. I had this guy trailing me the entire time, but I knew there was an opening up here and I could actually potentially spot her. So I sort of just kept running away from it. Figures I can make that brain shot, but I can't get the... Oh, I gotta get out of the way. Uh, I can't get the... Leucistic one when it's standing still. Another gold. And I think she died. Yeah, she's down right here. That was that was not good. I've been making some awful shots on rares lately. Really gotta make sure I don't start doing that on diamonds, but actually didn't land too bad. That's not a bad screenshot. I'm quite happy with that. Now We'll see what kind of incredible score we got for this. Every bit of 328. Wow. Okay, though. What happened there? I might, No, I just brain shot a... A different one, I think. I didn't actually look too closely, but... I don't really know how that didn't work. But anyway... Finally got the rare cape buffalo out of the way. I think I might have liked the leucistic better than albino. I don't know. Maybe eventually we can get both and compare. So those are the clips I've had saved up. Can't believe we finally got a rare cape buffalo. And it's what I figured, you know, tiny horns. It just looks kind of out of place opposite that guy. It really does, so I don't know. I might end up redoing stuff entirely. I'm not sure what I want to do, but... Got the diamond spring buck up there. This over here is actually the other diamond male gems buck, the one we got a while ago. I just think they look more impressive. I took down a, a gray diamond female and put him there instead. And 
got the new one above the fireplace, the 959, so a couple of nice changes to the Rahunga room, but I am really happy with the, the rare cave buffalo. Finally, you know, I don't know how many cave buffalo I would see. Not like you missed them, they're huge and all over the place, but yeah, finally did it, so quite happy with that. But anyway, that is going to do it, so thank you guys for watching, and I'll see you next time.